Irish voters have a habit of rejecting European Union treaties. If they continue to do this, the consequences could be severe. A refusal to participate in the EU's new fiscal compact would mean the Irish government would lose access to any financial help from the new permanent bailout fund, the European Stability Mechanism. Rejecting this treaty would also have implications on Ireland's membership of the Eurozone. The Irish government is telling voters a rejection of the treaty is a rejection of membership. The threat of a referendum has so far had little impact on the price of Irish government bonds. However, analysts say this could rapidly change. Ryan McGrath, senior bond trader at Dolman Security, says the general sentiment towards Irish bonds has been positive and people have been possibly overlooking the potential negatives that could come down the road. The government is expected to try and forge ahead with the new German-led budget rules, even though opinion polls indicate a referendum is favoured by the public. Julie Tennant, an economist at Good Body Stockbrokers, says a lot of the opposition parties are talking about court challenges and the like if they don't hold a referendum, regardless of what the Attorney General says. If a referendum were held, the Irish have a history of saying no to these sort of things. It could definitely have an unsettling effect on the markets. The government's existing loans from the European Financial Stability Facility will not be affected if the voters reject the compact. In 2010, they secured loans adding up to 67.5 billion euros from the EFSF and other governments, including the UK. The Irish government is bullish over their ability to repay their debts, but this is based on a projected growth of 1.3%, and Ireland's central bank this week lowered their 2012 projection to just half a percent. If Ireland can't finance itself through the bond markets, the voters have said no to the fiscal compact, then being cut off from EU financial aid will put the country's ability to pay off its debts in serious doubt. That's all for today, but we will bring you more on this as and when it happens.